What up, everybody? What's up, divas and divos? She throws back for a really inexpensive, synthetic, cheap wig video. Today is the day for synthetic wig. I thought that this week would be like the proper way to do inexpensive wigs. Like, I like to do inexpensive stuff because I know I am a frugal, frugal person. Like, I'm not trying to spend all my money on nothing. Especially if I could find something that looks just like it. Do the same thing, just as cute, honey, and budget friendly. So we're going to do that, okay? We're going to be doing an in inexpensive synthetic lace wig today by the Janet Collection. This is their Natural Super Flow Deep Part Lace Wig French. I have her in the color OET 1B-27. I've had this unit for a minute, and I was so indecisive of whether I should review it or not, but I'm going to, okay? I love the color of her, and plus I love Janet Collection. I always have, like, the best wigs, especially for synthetic, they have some really, really good affordable wigs. You definitely can check out Sam's Beauty because they carry a huge array of the Janet Collection wigs. And I'll I'll definitely link their information below. Y'all know how I feel about Sam's Beauty. They have amazing units, affordable prices, great shipping. So you'll definitely want to check them out. And I like this unit a lot because of the hair texture. This is really pretty. Like, this is a pretty wig. It is a middle part. And I'm pretty sure you can definitely put it to the side if you wanted to. For today's video, we're going to try this out in the middle part. Maybe I should have. Well, I got some makeup with me, so that's all that matters. There are combs in the unit right here in the front. I don't really like these because I always feel like it makes my wig kind of like not lay flat or flush to my skin. So let's put on some music so that I can listen to it. And you guys can watch this tutorial with me. All right, guys. So let's try this out. So first things first, you got to put the wig on, you guys. So I'm really feeling this wig. I like the color of it and all, and I love the texture. Janet Collection has really nice wigs. So what I'm going to try to achieve is just by placing some short hairs, wispy hairs, whatever you want to call it. Now, as you can tell from the hairline, it is thick. I'm going to cut these hairs. Now what I should have did, what I should have done did, is just brush it back or pull the unit back a little bit onto my own natural hairline and just kind of like pull some of my own hairs out. So as you guys see, I'm kind of like trying to shuffle it around, but I'm just not too happy with these hairs. Like, so then, you know, I try the hairspray because this gel is drying really fast and it is an equivalent of the got to be it's a walmart brand but it's drying awful fast and it's making life a little bit difficult so i attempt to try and put another set of baby hairs wasn't feeling that at all okay i just really wasn't feeling that now you did see me do that in slow motion. I'm going to show you that upsetness right here again. Got a little bit uptight. Girl, I've tried so hard to situate this. Like, if you notice on the side right there, my forehead is getting a little bit red, okay? I think it's time that I give up and try something much simpler for with your girls. So after a long dismay of trying to blend the wig, the hairline is very thick and I just really was not trying to paste it down. I'm gonna just paste my own hairs down. Like I'm gonna swoop it, swoop my sideburn hairs down, swoop my hair in a pattern, okay? That's what I'm doing. And as you see, I have a little bit of redness going on <laughs> on my skin from it being brushed so hard. So what I'm using now is just wax paste. And I'm also going to be needing some more of this makeup because I done brushed it away. So as you guys can tell already, I'm gonna make this into a headband wig. Listen, if your own natural wig, lace wig don't work right, just throw on a headband. It's the only way, it's the best thing to do. Like listen, don't nobody need to be getting frustrated by nobody's wig. Now Janet Collection, they make some bomb, bomb as hell wigs and they need to come out with a headband wig because this look really cute as a headband wig i'm just saying what y'all think you know listen 
I was not about to sit up there and fight with this lace wig. Like I wasn't going to do it. I just really didn't have it in me. Okay. The hairline was kind of thicker than I expected. And I wasn't going to glue that hair down with this gel styling and spiking hair gel. This is equivalent to the, um, got to be gel. Okay. But, um, by Walmart, I just really wasn't going to do that. And then I was like, you know what? Listen, girl, we're about to make this really fun and easy and also affordable to those who don't want to go out and buy a half wig or a headband wig. Girl, listen, go in your old wig stash. I'm telling you, this is going to be the best thing since sliced cheese, okay? Go into your old wig stash. I don't care if it's matted in the back. I don't care. It doesn't matter because all you're going to do is just slip it back some. You know what I'm saying? And put you on a headband. You can even cut out the madness. Make your own half wig headband, okay, girl? Like, make your own. And you can still do the same daggone stuff with it. Listen, I'm about to put this up in a bun, girl. Look, we're going to try this out really, really quick. Or a ponytail, whatever. you get it by now tell me what you learned in grade school give it to me like you want it did you forget that golden rule what is our love at one sided it should really be give and take fill you up and leave me empty baby was that my mistake covering these feelings Going through changes I'm just so mad right now I can't even think straight So I'ma just Tweet it and delete it Knowing you won't read it Before we get too far away Okay, so this is the best I could do because I didn't come prepared with no bobby pins or nothing. I was, look, I wasn't even prepared for none of this video. I was really prepared for this wig to act like it was supposed to and just work out itself. But being that it didn't and I ended up wearing this as a headband wig, I'm just saying, come prepared next time, April. Everybody come prepared. So I had to use like a wig clip. But you know what I'm saying? You could do the same damn thing with a cheap wig. It don't even have to be a half wig, okay? Girl, don't go out there spending extra money that you don't need to. I know y'all got wigs in your wig stash that y'all trying to hold on to. And y'all be like, well, you know what? I'm going to throw it out because I might, might really need it in like a few years from now. Like, you know, like, listen, I know this because I do this. I do the same damn thing. I will hold on to a wig. It don't matter if it's matted. It look old. It look like it's about to die. Okay, it's been extinct. I'm going to hold on to that damn thing. I'll be like, listen, I'm going to just cut off the little nappies, the frizzies, and the madness. And I'm going to just wear this. I might need this in like 10 years. I'm not a hoarder. I just say I'm not going to throw out any type of hair. So I know y'all got hair laying around like this. I know y'all do. So you know what I'm saying? Make you a headband wig out of any wig. Okay, girl, or half wig out of any wig and throw you on a cute headband. Oh, I love you guys. I got to go. Let me know what you think about this video and my t-shirt from Lovely Wholesale. Make sure you check them out. Check them out. Check, check, check them out. I'm hungry. Did you guys hear my stomach growl? But anyway, I got to go. I love you guys, and I'll see y'all on the next video. Tweet it and delete it.